The growing threat of North Korea missile attack has been worrying Seoul for decades. But only recently, when interception technologies became available on the domestic and global markets, there has been some progress in South Korean defense systems. To protect against North Korean rocket attacks, the Republic of Korea is building a three-level missile defense and air defense system, combining radar and interceptor missiles of various types into a single battle management system. The medium-range surface-to-air missile development project, or KMSAM, is considered an important component of South Korea's multi-layer air defense system. The KMSAM, which is also known as the TR Mare 2, was first developed by the South Korean Agency of Defense Development with technical support from Russian firms. It was based on technology from the 9M96 missile used on S-350E and S-400 missile systems and created to replace the older Hawk surface to air missiles that were adopted in 1964. South Korean companies that took part in the development include Samsung Thales, Dawson DST, and Lake Next One. The KMSM passed verification in 2015. First customer became the United Arab Emirates. In 2022, it was announced that the deal with UAE is worth $3.5 billion. A complete battery consists of four to six eight-cell transporter rotor launchers, a passive electronically scanned array, expand multifunction phase array 3D radar, and a fire command vehicle. The radar operates in the expand and rotates at a rate of 40 rounds per minute, covering up to 80 degrees in elevation. It can detect targets within 100 kilometers and track up to 40 simultaneously. A missile is 4.61 meters long and weighs 400 kilograms. It has a maximum range of 40 kilometers. Our original version could reach an altitude of 15 kilometers since 2021. An improved version is produced, which can reach 20 km. In terminal stakes, these missiles use active radar homing and can reportedly engage targets traveling at a maximum speed of Mark 15. The system can engage hostile aircraft, helicopters, UAVs, and missiles, including cruise missiles and short and medium-range ballistic missiles.